Good morning. I hope you're having a great day. I want to read today out of uh, 2 Corinthians 12.10. When I am weak, then I am strong. 2 Corinthians 12.10. God's idea of strength and man's idea of strength are opposite of one another. The Lord told Paul, My strength is made perfect in weakness. 2 Corinthians 12.9. Having learned this lesson, Paul could then say, When I am weak, then I am strong, in 2 Corinthians 12.10. A paradox? No, not really. Only when Paul admitted his own weakness and was willing to get out of the way, could God take over and wait and work. If we try to do God's will in our own strength, then we can take the credit for whatever gets accomplished, but that isn't God's way. When we let his strength work through us, then he alone will get the glory, and that is as it should be. In the Old Testament, God repeatedly told the leaders of Israel to reduce the size of their armies, or he announced in advance how their victory would be won. Why? So they would, could, would place their trust in him and not in their own strength. As someone has said, God's work done in God's way will never lack for God's provision. I pray that you allow God to lead you today.